I've always had the opinion that there is no difference between fufu flour and kokonte flour. So today I am taking you through how I turn my kokonte into delicious and healthy fufu. I'll begin by peeling my plantain. So I'm done peeling the plantain. We are going to cut them into smaller pieces sizable enough that the blender can blend. So this is what we have here. We are transferring it into a blender jar. You would add a reasonable amount of water. We are blending to smooth. And blending. We transfer it into a pot. Add three cups of coconut flour and mix. If we feel it's too thick, you will add a little more water, but it shouldn't be too watery. It's better to cook it and add more water than make it watery and mix till smooth without any lumps. At this point, you adjust the texture with little water and cover so the steam can cook it, depending on how soft or firm you want your fufu. And this fufu is just like the home fufu because you get to see the seeds of the plantain in your fufu, just like your Tinting the way you see the seeds. Cover and allow it to cook. I'm checking on the See, we are each. Asanka is also ready to help mold it. We can decide to mold it by pounding it a little in the asanka or we can just use a smooth round bowl to shape it and serve it i'm 
back to check on it. It is ready. Then we are going to use the bowl. We'll sprinkle a little water in the bowl and dish it into it. Move the bowl in a circular motion and shape it. Ewi asima de ye hi pan ne sa wudi obi ka na de bia obete sa wuwu fufu wo yusu method we ya obi an te se owo fufu wo ofie messengers peka kra spy ukonte reloaded meet kakra How it is. Mm. God bless you.